Ever wonder what a CO2 laser can actually cut? Knowing the right materials is the difference between clean cuts and costly mistakes. CO2 lasers cut wood like a dream, whether it's maple, walnut, MDF, all of it works great. Avoid glue heavy plywood though when you're trying to start cutting wood. When trying to cut glue heavy plywood, the laser beam doesn't want to work through the glue and makes it harder to cut. Cast acrylic gives off a nice flamed edge while you're cutting with the CO2 machine. Extruded works also, but it doesn't polish like the other ones. Real leather works great, making wallets, keychains, bags, cutting, engraving. CO2 lasers work great with leather, but always try to avoid synthetic leathers and PVC. They're very toxic. Another cool material you can throw into your CO2 laser is rubber gasket material. You can make stamps, patches, and gaskets. Just make sure that it doesn't have any chloride in it before you start cutting. Some plastics like Delrin and Mylar are safe to do as well. You just have to really read what's on it to make sure it's CO2 laser safe. What about food? Banana, tortilla, could you cut through with a CO2 laser? Yes, should you? Probably not. If you have any questions about materials that you can cut in your CO2 laser, feel free to reach out and make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell notification for all of our upcoming content.